Welcome to Around the World Channel. Bubba Wallace insists rope found in his NASCAR garage was a straight-up noose Daily Mail. NASCAR driver Bubba Wallace has insisted that the rope not found in his garage was a straight-up noose and said he was p asterisk 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 d with his critics after the FBI said there was no evidence of a hate. Steve Bing, film producer took his own life, coroner says, BBC News. Image copyright Getty Images filmmaker Steve Bing took his own life, a coroner in Los Angeles has confirmed. European stocks in the red as investors fret about rising U.S. COVID-19 infections, MarketWatch. European stocks fell Wednesday, as markets struggled to gain traction against a backdrop of rising coronavirus cases in the U.S. SoftBank raises $14.8 billion from T-Mobile U.S. share sale, Financial Times. SoftBank has unwound a big portion of its stake in T-Mobile U.S. in a deal set to inject $20 billion into the Japanese group as it battles shareholder concerns over its corporate strategy. Breonna Taylor's death looms over Kentucky's primary election, The Washington Post. Frustration and heartbreak over the Taylor case loomed over Tuesday's primary election in Kentucky, particularly in Louisville, home to most of the state's black population. Timothy Chalamet may no longer be single, eh? Vulture. It seems like just yesterday we were all reeling from the news that Timothy Chalamet had broken up with Lily Rose Depp, his girlfriend of a year and occasional yacht makeout partner. Deadly earthquake rattles southern Mexico, NPR. The earthquake along the coast of the southern state of Oaxaca, Mexico, on Tuesday caused several deaths and damaged property. Poll, what was your favorite announcement during Apple's WWDC Keynote 9 to 5 Mac? WWDC 2020 has already started and Apple announced new versions of its operating systems and a big change coming to the Mac. iPhone sales in China drop in May after recent rebound, but Apple shows signs of resilience, CNBC. Pedestrians walk past signage for an Apple Inc. store at the Shanghai International Center IFC shopping mall in Shanghai, China, on Tuesday, November 27, 2018.